When I beat this guy's position, low single, head and drive leg, high crotch, head and drive leg, double leg, head, drive leg, single leg, head, drive leg. Those are my two biggest enemies when this guy gets to my leg. If his head and his chin are up and his chest is big and he's got room to drive with his drive leg, then I got problems. That's where he starts to adjust. If his head's in the mat, he's on both knees, much easier for me to defend. So we're talking about beating the best guys. So we got to account for this. So he gets to low single, head and drive leg are up. Got to beat him, okay? So my lead leg is just going to jam right into his shoulder. I'm getting weight on my foot. I'm going to talk a lot about how much weight you continue to put on your feet to win a scramble. Height isn't something that wins in a scramble early on. More feet in the mat is what wins in the scramble early on. So I got to beat his head because his head's driving and he's circling and he's trying to put me on my hip. That's how he finishes his low single. So when he gets there, I immediately got to beat his head, jam his shoulder. I got my foot in the mat. Now I can't keep jumping over the top. I'm going to blow my knee out. So I just slide my knee outside his shoulder. Everybody see that? So I get weight on my foot and jam. And I slide outside his shoulder. I'm diving straight over the top. And I'm turning and facing. Don't grab anything with your hands. Just get your feet up under you in the mat so you're athletic. I'm going to talk a lot about being athletic. It's not you were born with good fast twitch muscles or your mom was a gymnast. It's feet in the mat. So when I tell you guys get athletic, that means get your feet in the mat and get your body in a good mobile position. Jam, slide, driving off this foot straight over the top. Watch my chest. Faces the mat the entire time. That's all I want you to do. Got it? Questions? Anybody need to see it again? All right, let's go. Let's work. Jam that shoulder, slide outside, dive over the top. Jam, slide, dive. Coach, how do you zoom on it again? Um, Just turn this dial right here. Oh, okay, the number dial. Yeah, All that right. dial right there. Left, left is in, right is out. Low single. Good, jam the shoulder, slide outside, dive over the top. That was good, you dive this time. Give me some effort on that dive. Other than that, that was good, man. You dive and Yeah, so just go as slow as you need to. So we're going to jam the shoulder first. Then slide your knee outside of it, and then dive. I want you to dive. Try to dive out here. Don't go to your right knee. I want you to dive your body out here. Turn it over the top. Keep your, heart Keep your chest facing the mat. That's not wrong. That's not wrong. We just want to be efficient. Okay? It's not wrong. We just want to be efficient. So low single. Jam the shoulder. Slide outside. Now dive straight over the top. Same direction as the spine. That's not bad. Now get to your hands. You injured? Don't hurt yourself. I was playing dodgeball yesterday and tweaked his knee. Uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> Jam that shoulder, slide outside, dive straight over the top. If you have a right leg lead, you're turning left. If you have a left leg lead, you're turning right. So essentially, you're turning back into that guy. 